The Sydney style picture profile from Technicolor gives you another picture style option for shooting video with your Canon DSLRs. Here is how you download it and install it on your Canon 70 and 80 Ds. Hi I'm Grant and this week's video is quite niche and it comes directly from a course I'm putting together on how to shoot video with your Canon 80D. I'm actually shooting this with the Cine Style Picture Profile there on my Canon 70D and I'll put a link to the Technicolor website where you can download the Cine Style Picture Profile which is free and a link to my upcoming course on how to shoot video with your Canon 80D. So without further ado, here's how you download it and install it on your Canon 80D. The last picture style I'll talk about here for your Canon 80D is a picture style called Cine Style. Now this does not come standard with your Canon 80D and you won't find it in your menu straight out of the box. So what you do in a nutshell is you go to a website called Technicolor, you download the Cine Style picture profile and you install it in your camera. Cine Style is essentially a log style picture style or picture profile. And what the purpose of this picture style is, is to help retain more color information when you're shooting, i.e. it retains more details in the dark areas of your, your shadows or your dark areas of your picture and still retain the detail in your, in your highlights or the very white areas of your picture. When you play back your cine style picture profile pictures, they almost look muddy or almost have like a white film over them. And essentially these are made, or this has been designed specifically for post-production editing, where you can generally edit your colors and your shadows and your highlights to get a little bit more information out in your picture. When I'm shooting this style of video, I don't generally use cine style because I don't do much color grading in the post-production edit. It's more about trying to get all the content up and out and online. However, when I'm shooting real estate for clients who are paying me good money to shoot these videos, I will just about always shoot cine style inside because I'm generally shooting inside houses which have bright highlights by the windows to dark corners in the room. So I'm trying to get as much information out of that, that picture as possible and I will do color grading or a bit of color grading to that picture to make it look really nice. So to get the cine style profile installed on your camera and to use it, here's what you do. You go to a website called Technicolor and I'll put the link in the description below. You click on the link here to download the picture style. Plug your Canon 80D into your computer via its USB cable. Open your Canon EOS utility that you get with your camera or else you can download it from the Canon website and I'll put the link below. Okay, now here's a trick which took me a little while to figure out because what we're essentially going to do is we're going to use one of these user registered profiles and we're going to install the cine style picture profile on one of these. However, the button on the back of the camera has to be in the white stills camera, not in the video camera, or else this user registered style will be greyed out. Okay, now open the user registered profile. Click on Install Profile, navigate to where you have downloaded the Technicolor Cine Style Profile. Install there, and that is it. It is on your camera. Now, if you open your picture styles on your camera, you will see Cine Style as an option. The final thing I do in the Cine Style Profile is I add a little bit of sharpening back because it comes default with sharpening turned right off. Now, to do this, go once again, select Cine Style Picture Profile, go into Info Detail Set, and I turn the sharpness strength up two notches. I leave the rest of the settings as they were, and now you have the Cine Style Picture Profile installed on your Canon 80D. That's it, if you're interested in my Canon 80D video course, there's a link below, follow that, leave your email, and I'll let you know when that course is ready. As always, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video. As you can see here, the space is not too bad, even though I'm showing you this on a wide lens. It is